my hair has become so long right now so the first thing i need to do today is get a haircut if you want to be notified every time i'm online click on that subscribe button and click on the bell icon next to it I say I love long hair, but after a point, I just there are times when I just I'm just like I want to chop it all off. It doesn't seem so long actually right now on the camera, but trust me, it is really long, and it's getting super hot here now. So I need to be able to chop off a little bit so that I can manage it better. So let's go. We're actually a bit late for my haircut appointment, so quickly I'm going to put my location. Like a new person. Short hair, don't care. Came back home, had water, ate, chilled. Let me know in the comments what you think of my new haircut, new look. Short hair, don't care. I went in with the idea that I want to keep my hair long, just get a little bit of like, you know, remove all the split ends, get some thode se layers, maybe thode se bangs. But when I was sitting there, I was like, oh, what the heck? Let's just get a fresh, proper haircut. It's been like, I think two or three years that my hair has been like long, just long, no style, no nothing, just like long hair. So I was like, oh, what the heck? Let's try something new. And so I chopped it all off. And the lady who was cutting my hair, I was like, oh my God, this is so short. And she's like, this is not short. This is actually long hair. For us, this is like long hair. Short is like when you go this short. But I made it to ye body short. It's like a like a damn proper haircut. But it feels good. It's crazy how much of an effect a haircut can have on your mood. Like really, I really feel like a new person. And let's hope Kali is a blow dry wood dry nickel jane ke baad bhi it stays nice and that it suits me. I also think it makes me look a little younger. What do you think? यहाँ पे already साढ़े छः तो already बज गए हैं अब dinner का time होगा उसके पहले I just want to shoot a bit of content um, with the new haircut so I'm gonna go do that. Get a sweat. I got tested positive for COVID today. It's my first time. I dodged it for well over two years now. Finally we got it. Someone else in the house started showing symptoms. They hadn't tested though. And as soon as I got the symptoms, um, I just went in and did my PCR because I had a feeling that it's more than just a flu. As in it's like the COVID flu, not the flu flu. And that's why I'm looking so behal. <laughs> Like just tired. But yeah, so that's that. I'm supposed to be in quarantine for the next seven days now. And so I plan to just chill, watch your shows, relax, hydrate, rejuvenate, eat. Although I am not able to eat at all, like I've completely lost my appetite. Like even if I swallow it hurts, so just don't feel like eating. But I am planning to eat because no matter whether you feel like eating or not, you must eat. That's how you get your strength. And also, I'm very excited about this uh, whole bag. This whole bag of food that my mom has sent. It has all this like healthy shit. Let me show you actually. So, we got this. Uh, this is haldi ka garam pani. This has chai, which was delicious. I'm gonna have my second cup right now. This is chundo, which goes with the kechula here. And this is pipramunno pani. It gives a lot of strength when you're sick, so you should have this. It's like spicy. Lots of disposable cups. Mm, look at that. This is soot pipramunni goli. Looks like that. It's supposed to give you strength um, when you're sick. Eating one right now. Slowly. Because throat. Really hurts. Mm. And then we also got this um, 
Adwala biscuit it's called which goes with the chai. What I'm going to do right now though is um, pour myself some chai and eat it with the tepla. Very excited. And this will be dinner. Also this chai has come in my uh, YouTube ka thermos. <laughs> Still hot. It smells so good. Oh god. I just came back home from the temple. So if you guys don't know, I'm Jain basically. And uh, this week, there's this thing called Ambil Dioli, which is going on today was the first day. This is not pollution. That's something else that comes in like August, September, that time. This is like another nine day thing. It's called Ambil Dioli. What you do is uh, you have to eat once a day. You can have water from sunrise to sunset. And when you're eating, the food that you can eat is, it has to be very minimal type of food. So without any taste maker. So you cannot use oil, you cannot use sugar, you cannot use any spices, so no masalas. You cannot use dairy, no vegetables, but you can use salt and pepper. That Those are the only like spices slash taste makers you can use. I think in my whole life, I've only done one amble when I was a kid, so I barely remember it. Today, I did one after like years and years and it was not bad. I was actually very surprised at how much variety of food you can eat, even with such few ingredients. Like you won't believe guys there was rasam vada when i saw rasam vada i was just like how did you make rasam vada without oil like what there was khichdi there was curry how do you make curry without any yogurt there was save which was also baked there was this like kurkure type of fryam type of thing there was mug there was dhokli there was rotli khakra papad khichu khichia um rice dal yeah it was all like sukha food so this is what I was wearing without these uh, shoes, obviously that would look very funny <laughs> if I did that, but um, 